Welcome back guys to a new Boom Beach video and let's see so we have one chest there let's collect that and then we have two more that we're going to work on today and that means that we're going to have enough keys to unlock the shock mine so let's go ahead grab that max it up of course and then today we're also going to be able to grab the shock blaster level two as well today so that's going to be pretty nice let's drop all these guys down that's definitely going to slow down our opponents let's drop them all down and we can't exactly hide them but let's just do our best over here to put them down where we think seekers and tanks or heavy choppers of course and heavies will walk across so let's put one there one there a couple of them over here definitely over here and there's two left so i'm not too sure let's put one there and i suppose one right over here in front of the uh, flame shore there Okay, so that's good. Let's hop into a battle and let's see what we can do. So we did reach rank 15 there and we got that lovely rank chest. Now our eyes are set on gold rank 16 there. So it'll be nice once we get in there for the extra upgrade tokens and of course those extra keys, which we definitely need because we're so far behind there. But let's see what we can do once we find this opponent. Rank 14, 14. Okay, and he's got my old base design. Okay, so let's just drop there. And let's drop one, two here. And what I'm going to do first of all is just drop some smokes off and let the heavies build up. And we'll just drop two there straight away. They should be able to distract those mortars and flame drawers there. And right about now, as they're as these smokes are coming coming out of range, let's drop Kavan over here as well. Okay, the first heavy chopper is gone. That's fine. We still have Kavan to drop, or not drop, but to bring back second wind heavies there. So what should we work on? Should we work on the... Let's take out this one over here. And I think that means we, we might we should be able to flare over to that right hand side uh, corner end room afterwards. Let's do a second wind here, help these guys out a bit more. There isn't too many heavies left, so we do have to... Let's do another second wind here. And we've got a nice line of heavies and Zuka still alive. Let's get ready for a, for a barrage here. On that end room, we do need it. Let's drop one down there. Is that going to be enough? Can we flare to the last end room? No, we can't. We're just out of... We just don't have enough GB there. If that was max barrage, I think that would have been enough there. But that means we got to let them take that one out and then we'll flare. So they're already on the last end room there. Well, let's do a barrage there. I can see the cracks in our last end room there. But can we grab it? 2 minutes 33, okay, I'm not sure it's totally up in the air here because it's 2 minutes 33. Let's take a spectate and 2 minutes 30, nice. We just about got it there because I think he went all the way around the base uh, attacking each engine one at a time there. So, 3 second win, I'll take that, I'll take that. Let's grab. Let's go and grab it. And back up to rank 15, there we are. So that's how it's been going. We win, win 1, lose 2, win 2, lose 1. So let's go, 15-15, so fair battle. Okay, I'm, I'm tankable, he just doesn't have shocks, the shock mines or the shock launchers. So let's drop these guys down, and what I'm going to do here once again is drop down smokes. That's going to take about 10 seconds off our time, that's how, how long the smokes last, but it's definitely going to be worth it to build up the uh, heavies at the start. And right about now, there it is, okay, now the Zookas are walking up. Okay, the heavies themselves are taking out the first couple of defenses, that's fine. And we'll just delay drop Kavan in there with them as well there now. So these mortar shells, we really gotta watch out for these mortar shells. They can take that they can take out a small cluster of Zookas with the stray uh, mortar shells. So let's do our first second wind here. And I suppose we'll just use our GB to back up the troops here to be honest. Um, let's see, let's see if we can take out the Doom Cannon. I didn't even see how much troop health or what stat nodes he had. But I don't think he has the... He has the defensive building health for sure. Let's do another second wind over here. And let's just use our GB to take out some of these defenses. That'll help us out quite a bit. And, okay, those guys are gonna die there. Let's bring them back down here. Second wind Zuka's there. Lovely stuff. Okay, come on guys. We're on our way there. Two end rooms left. Let's do a barrage over there. Let's flare over here. And then flare over there. Is that perfect timing? Yes, it is. And just a mech kit there. 
he's on our last one as well. Two minutes thirty one, one second better than our last um attack time there. So let's take a spectate here. He's just about finished there. Two minutes forty four. Nope. Okay. So all heavy rush and he had a uh, thirty percent troop damage there, hundred percent defensive building damage there, okay. So they're fortunately not gonna win there. But let's go back. We have to collect these ender rooms and is that gonna be enough? That's gonna be enough for this one. And we have to collect one more before we can grab the nice blaster. We could actually grab the boom cans over there. But let's just keep going over here. The blaster's gonna be nice and then these crew launchers are definitely gonna you know, stop stop all heavy chopper rushes there with their passive critters there. So that's going to be the plan for right now. And then we might go back to grab the shock launchers and, and uh, shocks, of course. So the blaster, I'm not sure where to put the blaster. Let's take a look at the replay over here for a second. Now, he was using all heavy chopper rush. So I'm not sure where exactly. Okay, maybe down here then somewhere or over there. Yeah. Okay, so let's let's do that then. Let's put it right over, yeah, it's here right over here so that I can't be shocked. And there, okay. Let's try that. And that should really give something for the opponents to watch out for there. Okay, this guy does have every single, every single uh, defense there. He's got two shocks. He doesn't have the shock mine, so he must have went the middle path, obviously, because of the shock launchers. But let's just do our best here. Drop these guys over here. We'll of course do a smoke because they're, they're going to be, if they shoot for too long over here, they're going to be targeted straight away and the heavy choppers will be shot down. So we'll just wait for them to build up some heavies there. And let's drop down our Zookas. We should drop down our Zookas a little bit earlier there. But let's see. So let's take out this one. Tree barrage there, is that overkill? It probably is. We probably only needed two there. Okay, that's fine. The mortar shell is coming into play there. We're going to lose our first heavy chopper here in a second. It's literally down to like 10% health there. Do a mech it over here. Zookas. Oh, the Zookas. Zookas, Zookas. Okay. It's nice that we have the maxed out mech kits to help against the shock launcher shocks. Let's do another second wind. Oh, that's going to be painful there for sure. We definitely need troop health then. Well, let's keep going over here. So let's just, I'm going to flare onto that shock launcher in a second here. Yeah, let's flare on it right there. Now it's, everything's in the clear. Do a mech kit on Kavon there. And wow, okay guys, that shock launcher really did take us out there. And we also just, just about lost Kavon there in the end when the troops turned to the right hand side, unfortunately. So we are going to lose this. Can we get it? I think we have a handful of Zookas left up, but there's there's not too much single shot buildings, I mean. But if we can keep these heavies alive... No, we're not going to be able to. We're, we'll be able to take down this one over here at least. Zooka's doing a nice bit of damage there, but nope. Yeah, they're going to be picked off there, and the opponent has already taken us out. We're at 2 minutes, 8, 7, 6, 5 there. Okay, so let's go back to bat for that one. We just don't have enough... Uh, Defenses and troop stats there. So maybe we should go back to perhaps building a base like the opponent there But I mean we don't have all the defenses yet. So we don't have the mortars. We don't have the boom cannons Don't have shock launchers that would be really good against the cluster uh, in a cluster base design So for us right now, I think kind of makes sense to try and spread out the engines as far as possible Okay, this this person has the same idea except he does not have the defenses at all. So let's just drop all these guys down and we'll just flare onto this one straight away. And let's just take this one out first, actually. We shouldn't be losing too many heavies down here anyway. We'll just do a few second wins. Let's see, he does not have the defensive building health anyway. And we'll be able to work our way slowly through here. He does have max flame chores though, but he doesn't have max machine guns for some reason, even though he does have all the machine guns there. Okay, let's get ready for that next and last barrage. Hopefully that's going to be it there. Machine guns doing absolutely nothing for damage against our Zookas. Nice to see that. And we don't need to rush right now. He's still on 5 there. He's on 4 now. Okay, he's on 3. Okay, maybe I spoke a bit too early there. Let's let's flare over here and then we'll flare to the last one. Even though there's a flame to right in front of it there. 
Go right there. Just try a bunch of mech hits there. He's on two, okay. Second wind, two minutes fifty-nine, and that was that's decent there. Two minutes fifty-seven, okay, definitely decent because he had no not much defenses there. Two fifty-seven is his time to beat. What's he gonna get? Two fifty-six, nice. So he's he's yeah he's able to take down our base. There's the barrage coming in, perhaps too late there, because his Zuko's already on it. But we're not gonna complain there. So let's grab the win over here. Nice. So 10 stars as well. Okay, nice. Lovely that. And let's go ahead and grab the next one as well. So, nope. Okay, so we don't have enough keys for that. Let's just keep going. Maybe we can go back and grab the boom cannons. Because that would definitely be a nice little uh, defense. We need to grab the boom cannons and the mortars there. And let's let's grab the quitter launchers first. Because I like how they're going to shoot at quitters and like stop his troops dead in their tracks. They're going to slow down his troops and really mess up, for example, Seeker attacks, heavy attacks, heavy and Zuka attacks there. So let's see. Okay, so let's come at it from... Let's see. Let's come at it from the left-hand side. And we'll barrage out this engine over there on the right-hand side there. So that's going to be a plan. Let's smoke, smoke. Nope, that... Let's do a smoke on that, actually. Nope, actually, that's actually too much there. There it is. Kavan is gone, no. Kavan, he, the Doom Clan could have targeted any of the Zookas there, guys. But unfortunately, we just got picked off at the wrong moment there. Okay, so I think... Let's do our best here. Mortar shell hitting our Zookas on the side. Okay, we're going in there anyway, that's fine. Let's see, what can we use our GB on? That's fine. Let's just use our GB on... Let's just take out one of those. No, we might actually have to take out this one. Okay. So a couple of Zookas left on this side over here. But the mortar, sh mortar is really pounding them in, guys. There, It's just destroying whole clusters of Zookas there. And he's already taken us out as well. So we totally uh, misread the situation here. Let's go ahead and grab that engine there. I don't care if all the Zookas die. We should be able to last long enough to take it out there. Flame Chore isn't even, ma isn't even maxed out there. So 2 minutes 31 there is the time we've been typically getting it seems. I thought the time would have been a bit slower there. And he's on rank 15. I'm not sure if, if he just ranked up there. Okay, so we lost by what's only 10 seconds there. Okay, let's do one more here. We have, we're falling out of rank 15 there. Uh, okay, no, we don't have enough uh, troops, but yeah, that's how it's been going, guys. We'll see what we can do. We'll grab the, we will grab quitter launchers and then we'll see. There's a lot of stuff that we definitely need. We need the shock, shock launchers. We need shock bombs would be a game changer, to be honest. And of course, we have to eventually go back and get the defenses, the boom cannons, the mortars, the 50% building health that we have skipped would be pretty nice there. Uh, might consider taking the hit on one of these eventually, the building damage, perhaps mostly. But yeah, that's going to be it from me today. Tomorrow, we will unlock the critter launchers and we'll see how that goes. But yeah, let me know how you guys are getting along and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe.